Hello, hello everyone, and welcome back to Transport Fever 2. And after redoing the whole Fresno last time, today I have another big project. So what I want to do is to create a new passenger line, but I want to connect more areas as well because we're concentrated like for a long time now in the same area. And there are cities here that still need connection. So I want to create a high speed passenger line from Olaf, if that's how you pronounce it, uh, that goes through Vallejo or Vallejo, something like that. Then stopping at Grand Rapids, so we have the, the connection to the airport there as well. And then we go into Topeka, and then we go around and finish in Nashville. So that's the new line that I want to build. I think some of these places will be like a hub for going to other cities and uh, things like that. But that's what I want to do. And uh, today I'll do a speed build because I think there'll be a long way to go here and probably have to change a few things along the way. So uh, I hope you guys enjoy it and I'll be back at the end with the, the results. I'll see you soon.
we are back and now I do have the full line here I just took a look at it and make sure that all connections were done and all terminals were properly connected as well so just as an overview then before we we move on we start here in Olaf and then we go through uh, Vallejo we have a stop here and then we go all the way through Grand Rapids we go around the airport here and stop in Topeka and then we go through the mountains and underneath the highway and we resurface in here so we go all the way there doing this crossing that I think that's really really nice going inside the mountain and getting through the water here is just like a pretty nice place actually and getting underneath the mountain as well uh, not as well again and stopping at Nashville and on the way back as well so it seems like a pretty nice uh, line here so what I'm going to do now is connect the bus stations and obviously by the train or this line otherwise we won't have uh, many people using it <laughs> but in any case let's uh, create the bus stops in here so look at bus stops and we go from well definitely want to stop in here at the train station which should cover not much but in in case that would be more than enough then i think we can go here yeah all this area is covered another one there and then we have a in here i think we are all good so everyone is covered now let's create a new line for that here here and there and we can call it let's identify it by passenger and Nashville loop I think that'll be fair Now we do need a depot. Let's get one there. Don't know if I add it here. Would make sense to have it close by. Maybe leave some space there if we need to add more stuff to that station and we can buy or sis in here so for this loop I think we can buy just two buses and the color for that is the light purple and that goes to Nashville loop now let's take a look at the other cities as well so we make sure everyone is well catered and have destinations correct destinations planned and these what do we have here so we have a few lights in here plenty of passenger lines as well so we have this that goes to Denton and Ventura that one remains and we have this is the train maybe I should change it quickly passenger train and we have Killing and Ventura which goes the other way there okay 
and we have Fremont, which goes in here. So thinking about this, I might change this slightly. I can probably create like a bus station in here and send them all there and we use this area as bus stops only. So bus and train station. We need three platforms, so maybe like this. Bigger one. Not sure if that's a good way to do it, but we can always try. Yeah, I think that'll be all right. So taking a look at the lines that we have here, we now need to make sure that these lines all connect there. So looking at this, we have a few stops here. So five, six, and seven. I'm just thinking we get into the city here. Do we need all? Yeah, this is a big city. So from here, probably want to go this way and connect there and then get out and connect here and there so five and then I'll remove this one so we go here so let me double check this because I might be taking, looking at the wrong way here. So stop four, six streets. Stop five to pick a halt. Stop six. It goes back to view streets. Stop seven. Okay, well that's that's all right. I think we need to add a waypoint so we don't go back through here, we go back that way. Or maybe we can just upgrade roads here. I think we might need to do this. And we can do that too. didn't do anything so <laughs> let's add a waypoint there or let's take a look and see what we're missing here we are missing this area so I'll probably put a bus stop down there maybe here and then we can add a new new stop there before View straight, so we get here. Okay, go in, go out. Okay, that's fine using that road. I don't really care. Six, seven, eight, and goes back. Now for this one, we just have that stop. Uh, so first station here, I want to be that one. Then we can add this. Not sure if that's great, but I think that that could work. Unless we want to do that loop as well. So maybe we go from here, there, there. And on Walk Street, we stop on the other side of the road. And there we 
we go. And then everything else would be the same. Now this one we just did. And the one that, oh hold on. This one's going there, that's correct. This one we haven't done. So view streets and it goes our way. So we need to add a new station here and then add view streets. So start here, go there. Hopefully it's not too messy. And go all the way there, okay? But then on the way back, we shouldn't forget that. What is number eight? Eight, nine, 15 streets. And then we should actually add another one here. So 10 and then go back to one. Okay, let me just make sure that this is correct as well. Washington streets and yeah, I think it's fine if we go straight back there. We don't need to go all the way here because then they can do the loop. Fine. And this one, just did this one. It's fine. So five, six, seven, eight, and go back. Yeah. Okay, this is all right. So Topeka is sorted. Let's take a look at Grand Rapids now. And this, we do have, let me have this line selected. So we have one passenger line that goes to Fresno in here. So that's that should be easy. Let's stop there, go back to line and at the station. So I'll like to do that as the first one. Oops. Let's add one here. Remove this. So one, two. Why is it going around like that? Interesting. There is no reason whatsoever. Maybe just because of the work stop there, I don't know. And then it goes there, and then on the way back, it goes straight. Uh, maybe we just add another one here. So we stop on both sides and go back to the station. Done. So by the way, we don't need to add any buses in here or here because the lines were right there okay and then we have Vallejo which we probably don't have any yeah we don't have any lines there so let's create a new one then definitely one stop here this should cover just this small area Probably, well, that covers almost everything. Could do one here and another one. Oh, but then it's not over. You know what? Let's do this. I think this is more than enough. And we create a new line there, here, there, there, and there. Okay, so this will be the uh, 
I hope I got it right. No, I didn't. Double L. And we need a depot somewhere. To be honest, I'll put this somewhere else, probably in here. And then we have to buy two buses. One should be more than enough, but let's buy two. Let's see. Same thing, the electrical bus, the easy taro. And this should be this nice color. Look. And last one, so Olaf, this is a new city that we haven't done anything yet, so no lines in there, let's do something, and why should we put it as top, probably in here, so it's not on the main road there, which I should probably upgrade, but let's leave it like that. So we have one here, which covers all this, then oh, that's good. I think if we had a connection here, it would be better, but let's do it. Let's get this here. Probably here. More than, more than enough as well. Let's get these streets. And connect a small road there. And let's create our line. So new line. Here. Here. In there. Okay, he's not gonna use that is interesting and this will be passenger Olaf loop maybe if I do this myself yeah great and this is so building a depot. Yeah, Dublin City is too far to buy there, so let's add one in here. I'll probably use this space here. This is fine. Let's get. Same thing, two easy throws and giving that color and sending to the loop. Now, the last thing that we need is our high speed train. So, this would be exciting. I want to go electric, and well, the fastest train that we have is 200k. So why do we have a 300 line? Hmm. But anyway, so let's take a look. Looks like this one would be the best option. Although this has less power, actually it has more power but less attractive effort. This one has more, but this is a lot lighter as well. Okay, let's get this, the HHP-8, which I, we are using in some cargo rails as well, which is interesting. Now for the passengers, we do have this one. Oh, maybe we have those, yeah. Oh, 300, yes. That'll be expensive. 
13 million dollars, almost 14 in per year. Ooh. Ooh, that's <laughs> that hurts. Uh, let's well, let's get it. Oh, that's a full train. Nice. So look at the power of this train and the attractive effort. That's like, that's it, right? Don't wanna hear about it. So this goes to what line do we have here? So this color and let's send it to that line. Oh, everything's coming along now. Let's take a look. Come on, my little train. Our first passenger line. And it's a highway speed. Highway speed? What, what, what is it in that? <laughs> <laughs> it's a high speed train. That's what I meant. Oh, this is so good. Look at that. Look at how many, much money we're spending already on this line. Oh, that's a big train as well. Yeah, I love that. So we're getting into that station. Hopefully all the buses start as well around the city yeah we have passengers waiting we, mm, we should probably increase the size of our stations there or we don't care about that I just want to see this getting up to speed because like it's 60 kilometers just at the beginning maybe because of this and then yeah and then it should go faster now let's speed things up a little bit or fastest train look at that That's good. Oh, so many people getting into the station. Ah, they lost the train. And we, oh, we're getting fast. Yeah, I don't think we, uh, obviously we won't get to up to 300 in this area because we have some very close stations in here. But 183 was what we got there. But I think on the last uh, on our our final destination, we probably should get there. But yeah, look at that. 180, and we should be more than 200. Yeah. Oh, nice, 220, nice. Have some passengers there already. That's great, still not enough people. Hopefully we will get some, some people there. We're in Nashville, we do have a lot of people waiting. Let's take a look. 52 people there. That's the only connection to the outside that they currently have, so it has to be popular. And here we go. Oh, it goes pretty slow there. Oh, I messed up the bridge. Okay, I'll have to fix that. Let's pause. just before you go my bed 
Let's do this. And we need I like this. There we go. That's why it's important to always try it when you finish building because you usually you mess up something or another. So there you go. Now we can go. Okay, let's leave it running and see how that goes. We have 25, 30, 30 people waiting here. We have some people waiting there. 55 people waiting here. And 86 in Olaf as well, which is the not the only connection because we have a road in here, but it's the fastest connection to those cities. I mean, really, really happy with the outcome so far. We might need more buses in here, or maybe not, or maybe do, because like they get here, they get full. Yeah, I think we need one more, just one more would be enough. And Olaf is growing as well. 231 people. Some good progress in here. I really wish we can make some money here. <laughs> because this is a very expensive line there. Uh, let's take a look at this. We have, oh, a lot of people waiting there. So we probably need two more. Let's take a look at how this goes. Yeah, there's a lot of people using this, so in here as well. This makes me think that we might want a tram line instead. I'll actually do something a little bit different there. Crowd in a train, have a train filled with at least 100 passengers. Oh, we have a full train. Nice. Sorry, building, you have to go. And this one. This. This. And then we can connect that. I think I want a straight line there. Just saw the lines, uh, they're still going there, but well, have some different routes. Well, we might need another train this line, and we are making money, yes. That's great, and I think we need another train on this line, because we have too many people waiting. Oh yeah, <laughs> oh I'm so happy with this line. First time we did the passenger train here, and it's very successful, I would say. We might need one more bus in here. I think I'll do that. Yeah, we have a lot of people waiting there. You have five people. Yeah, we definitely need another train there. 
Let's get it. Oh yeah. <laughs> Look at that. Two traits. I'm so happy with that. You guys have no idea. And on this one. Oh, we might have a lot of people here as well. Ah, it's because it goes to the other city. Mm, we might need to go a loop there. Not sure. Let's see. Well, this is getting the whole city, so not really, just more buses. Probably two more there. And maybe if I take a look at this. Are they the Sitaro? Yeah, they are. Look at how much money this line is making. That's huge, that's huge. Couldn't be happier there. Okay, so let's take another look at this one as well, because it seems that we have a lot of people waiting. Yes, we do. So this line. Okay, I might need to replace that. Let's replace. So this gets 26 people, this 17. And I might add a few more. 21 in the line should be more than enough. The other lines seem to be fine. This one is okay. Which one is that? Need to manage that as well. Let's take a look. Manage vehicles. Let's replace them. They are all new flyers, so let's change to Sparrow. And probably add two more. This one, a lot of people waiting here. We have a bit of traffic in there. Hmm. We might need a different bus stop there. Too many people. Why do we have this stop so close? Ah, this one is going that way. Okay. Fair enough. Okay, I might add a new bus stop there, so like this. How many lines do we have there? Three lines. And let me add this. This should be all right there. So I do have two on the left, one on the right. There. Now we do need to go here. Let's pause this a little bit. So stop three. I want to add one here. And remove stop three from there. 
now this one stop seven so let's add let's add this one and remove seven and two and ten i think that's the one Uh, that's confusing. So <laughs> let's remove 10. Okay, yeah, that's correct. All right, I think this is what we need to do. Let's take a look. All the people walking there to the new stop. Okay, much better. Then we don't have that traffic in here. Fine. Oh, 10 million just on that line. And from here we go to Nashville. And let's take a look at how many people we have 119 people there. Okay, almost a full train just there. For the buses, we have four people waiting, five people should be. Yeah, it's alright for the number of buses that we have. That's great. And loaded. Let's take a look at the line. And manage line. Actually, it's not what I want to see. I want to see this. We are making $14 million just on this line alone. I think it's the most lucrative, lucrative line that we have. Well, not now, but yeah. Again, I think the only ones that are making more money are the are, are planes. which are great. Can we change this to something else? So what do we have here? These are Boeing 757. 757, what? 200 PF SF, this one. So cargo, all cargo with how many? Fifth one. More, but this one is still faster. Yeah, it's still the best plane that we have. Okay. I'm really happy with the results today. And I hope you guys enjoy this as well. Because these were like big chains and was a bold move, I'd say, here, because there was a lot to do, and this was a huge line, but I'm really pleased with the results. I like this station as well. Oh, so many people there. We might need another train here, that's what I think. And to be honest, then I think it's worth it. Like, why not? Oh, so happy with that. Well, I really hope you guys enjoy it. I'm really happy with uh, our results and the outcome so far. And let me know in the comments what, what you think about this. Uh, for tomorrow, I will do just a cab view from one of these high-speed trains. And uh, just so we, we see the whole uh, area that they go through and I hope you guys enjoy that as well. So thanks again and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye!